Hi friends. Welcome to Dentistry Love Channel. Bleaching Part 8 Thermocatalytic Technique Same as the walking bleach technique but heat is applied using different instruments. Due to the heat and high concentration of bleaching agent, cervical root resorption could occur. Not recommended for routine use. Procedural steps include Step 1, coronal restoration is removed completely, access preparation is improved, and gutta percha is removed apically to just below the cervical margin. Step 2. Next, the pulp horns are cleaned with a round burr. Shaving a thin layer of dentin from the facial wall is optional and may be attempted at later appointments if discoloration persists. Step 3. A protective cement base 1 mm of glass ionomer cement base was placed over the gutta percha to form a barrier between the sealed root canal and the bleaching material, mechanical seal. Step 4. A loose mat of cotton is saturated with 30% H2O2 placed on the labial surface and another is placed in the pulp chamber of the tooth to be bleached. Step 5. The solution is activated by exposing it to light and heat from a powerful light. The tooth is subjected to several, usually 5 to 6 minute exposures and the bleaching solution is replenished at frequent intervals. Step 6. On completion of the bleaching process, a pellet of cotton moistened with hydrogen peroxide, or hydrogen peroxide and sodium perborate, is sealed in the pulp chamber until the following appointment. Hydrogen peroxide is added to the cotton every 5 minutes during the bleaching process. The techniques can be used by themselves or in combination with the walking bleach. Since the clinical results of both these techniques do not appear to differ, the walking bleach technique, which is easy to perform, consumes the least time, and requires no special equipment, is the method of choice. To reduce the possibility of resorption, immediately after bleaching, a paste of calcium hydroxide powder and sterile water is placed in the pulp chamber. Also, sodium perborate alone, rather than in conjunction with hydrogen peroxide, should be used as the primary bleaching agent. Although sodium perborate may bleach more slowly, it is safer for the tooth. Cervical resorption has been observed most when using a thermocatalytic technique with high heat. Periodic radiographs should be obtained after bleaching to screen for cervical resorption, which generally has its onset in 1 to 7 years not more effective technique yet dangerous. Thank you friends. Please do subscribe for more videos.